Hey, sneaky nice back today. Today we've got another one for you. If you like Gen 2, that is. We've got Turox. Yes, Turox from Deutschland, Germany. This is the 32 bit version of Turox Lite. So, Turox Lite comes with XFC E4.10, but you get a few different options and it's smaller apparently, although it's still 900 odd meg to download, so it's quite large. So, this is the easy way for Gen 2, or another easy way for Gen 2. There's quite a few out there at the moment. Just a quick look for you, and we'll go through it and see what it comes with as standard. Okay. Ordinary desktop, they've got home, hard disk, live chat, and make a Torox USB key. Nice. And the menu. Okay, you get the user XFC stuff here. Terminator, file manager, mail reader, web browser, and settings. Because it's XFC, by the way. So all your stuff's there, and the settings manager's there, so I'll open that up as well. Look, it's all nicey, nicey, lovely, jubbly. I like it, look. And, i say what, it's bleeding quick. Yes, bleeding quick. There's a few problems at the moment, but I will tell you them right at the end. But they're only if you've got a Radeon um, graphics card, okay? So under accessories, usual, usual, but you do get 7-zip. Mmm, for your zipping. Orange and leaf pad here, of course, don't forget about them. Terminal, task manager again. Thuna is there, and XF burn for burning biscuits. Or biscuits, even. Yep, code for Blocks IDE and the Sandbox. Under Graphics, all you get is Font Forward, Mirage, and Xane Scanner. Okay. Under Internet, we do get Claws Mail as your standard mail client here. Midori for your browser. Okay, but remember, you can get whatever you want. Pigeon is a standard, as so is Transmission. Under Multimedia, we have Audacious. Yes, okay. AU Mix, a mixer, Parole for playing your vidvos. SWFDEC Flash Player and XF Burn again. He likes it here, old XF Burn, doesn't he? He likes getting every menu. Oh, yes, indeed. For your other stuff, right, you get Abbey Word. Right, there's nothing for, um, <clears throat> should I say, there's no G numeric, should I say, for doing stuff like that. Bit of a bummer, but hey, never mind. But Abbey Word is here. Let's see what version we're running with Abbey Word. Begin nice and, see, it's nice and quick there. It's really good, isn't it? With version of, oh, I see, it's too bloody quick for my hand. Hmm. Oh, it's only 282 or 286, whatever that is. That's how many numbers he's got in there? We'll call it 2864 now, okay? So it does what it says on the tin, okay? And the system. You get G-Parted, Bulk Renamer, Manage Your Printing, Potato, Potato, did you get that? Potato. Task Manager and Terminal. So I'll open up the Task Manager for you. As you can see, it's not doing anything. It's actually asleep, okay? <sighs> Yeah, it's like that. Back to the system, okay? Then you've got the Porto Portage front end. This is how you get all your stuff, okay? So I'll open him up and it'll probably tell me to go away or something like that. If it's going to open up at all. Yes, it's spinning, spinning. It's spinning and spinning. It's thinking about it, isn't it? It's thinking about it. So what I'm going to do, we're going to go to another window and just do something else from the spinny thing. Oh, no, here it is. Let's come back. You know, you must have root privileges, but basically, this is their, like, um, as we say, a bit like Synaptic, I suppose. Yeah, more like Synaptic than anything else. If you've used Gen 2 before, you know what you're looking at. But this is where you get all your stuff, okay? This is where you get it all. I'm not going to do it at the moment, so don't worry. Because I'm just showing you what it looks like if you fancy downloading it and using it. Right, that's enough of that over there, okay? Now, over here, we have the Starter. So, click Starter. It's just a, a quick thing, so... so Bubbles. So icons just to do quick stuff really at the end of the day. So burn a CD, a music player, FTP connections, watch a movie with parole, browse the web, write a letter, you know, that sort of thing. It's just like quick start launches, shall we say. Now next one is system config, where you can config your system. So you get auto start, Bluetooth, do all that here, do your display here, but you can do your display as soon as you uh, boot the system from the live CD. You can actually set your uh, display resolution, shall I say. Yeah, all right. Your software and sand card, you can do it, but it all, it all works out of the box for me, so no big deal. I'll get your flash plugin as well here. Ha 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 ha, because they can't really give it to it by default, can they? System monitor, of course, there's Claws Mail. Midori is the browser of choice here. I haven't had it crash on this one somehow. Now, it uses Start Page, the world's most private search engine. So it doesn't find much because it, nobody knows it's there. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to put Turox in and we'll see what it comes up with. Reasonably fast, as you just see there. So we go there, Turok's Live Linux System. Here we are, this is their home page. And as you can see, we are using kernel 338. Comes with XFC 4.10, it tells you about here. Exalt 1.12.3, blah, blah, blah. You can get the bigger one, bearing in mind, but it comes with more stuff. 
comes with LibreOffice and Chromium and Gimpy and lots of other bits and bobs that you may want. But it is a larger download, okay? Yes. No, no, it's a, it, it is it's a larger download. It sure is. It comes in several languages as well, by the way. Yeah, I've got to. This is the problem I was telling you about. It's only if you've got a Radeon HD graphics card do you get the problem. But there's a fix for it, and he's going to release it really soon. What is Turox? Basically, Turox is a live Linux DVD based on Gen 2 that starts with Nopix or Knopix, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, it's all there, isn't it? We'll do another one up here. We'll go to a different page. See what it comes up when we do the bit back here. See, it comes quite quick, isn't it, really? Yeah, it's all right. We'll see what comes out here. Lovely jubbly. All looks good to me. It works. It does what it says on the tin. Right, that's enough of that. So, if you fancy a Gen 2 system but don't want the hassle of a 48 hour install, this could be one for you. A bit of Gen 2, bit of Turox, all done on a disc for you. It will install hunkily dorily if you want it to. Nice, I like it. You know, I like it so much, I'm going to give it 90%. Super of the duper. I'm liking it. Turox, yeah, baby, yeah. I'm gone. Bye. <laughs>